All right, y'all. Uh, back here with another belt review. This one just came in. I apologize for the shitty carpet. I uh, don't have much else at this point in time. My family is in the living room, and this is where I am, my bedroom. All right, so what we can have here, as I'm sure you can see, is everybody's favorite version of the World Heavyweight Championship. The WWE version, yay! Of course, Song's nameplate, because this is a used version, and well, my nameplate is still coming. No, it will not be personalized, it will be an Edge rated R nameplate, because Edge, that's why. So I guess getting started here, this is the uh, Figs Ink version. It's uh, two millimeters, as you can see. It's uh, not the thickest plate in the world, but it's still got some weight to it, though, which is nice. And, uh, again, the etching on this isn't, uh, isn't 100% the greatest thing I've ever seen. It's pretty shallow, but the wrestlers all look pretty good. And, uh, yeah, you can see that there and that one. And then if we go down here, you can see uh, some of the tooling on the strap there. And I got a cat in here now too. And there's of course one snap box, the five, and five by eight. Now, some of the touches uh, on this strap are quite nice. It's a little bit of tooling there on the ends. You can see a bit of snap button damage there. That probably happened in shipping, but it's all good. And, uh, yeah, that's my cat. Come on, Smuggies. Howdy here. Good girl. But, yeah, there's some more of the tooling on the strap there. And, uh, again, these gems and the grommets are super nice. Quite happy with them. They are a lot bigger and shinier than I thought they were going to be. So we'll just flip this over here. And, uh show you the official mark that's the figs ink not exactly sure when this one was made it says copyright 2004 but i'm pretty sure they all say that and of course it does have that patented wwe fake ass strap so the back is the same as the other ones as you'll see on the new shop straps uh, of course the front is a bit different though because it's the smooth because it's the big gold so, I mean, there is some wear and tear on this belt, obviously, uh, being that it's used. And, you know, again, I don't know how long it's it's been had for. But, I mean, as you can see, you know, there's some wear in the strap here. Nothing too, too bad. Um, I don't know how long the gentleman before me had it, but I know how, I'm gonna, how long I'm going to have it for a long-ass time. So, that's pretty much about it. Um... I haven't seen the commemorative version of this belt, but I do have the commemorative version of the white in our Continental Championship. And, uh, I mean, the plates on it look great. It's definitely not nearly as heavy as this guy, um, nor near as shiny, obviously, because it's, you know, painted plastic. Um, but I do got to say, you know, obviously the metal belts are, are much better than the commemoratives. Once I get my uh, shop... Um, I intercontinental replica in uh, about a month or so. I'm going to put up a review on that side by side with the shop commemorative replica. So keep an eye out for that. Um, but I mean, in terms of, you know, in terms of metal belts, I got to say this is probably pretty much up there. You know, I've got a couple of, uh, a couple of brass belts through fight night belts. Um, and they are also absolutely fantastic. Everybody knocks brass, but I'm telling you right now, man, uh, the two that I've picked up from Fight Night are second to none. I mean, I've seen a lot of uh, a lot of good zinc belts, including this one, but uh, the reviews on those ones are going to be coming up. Actually, you can probably see my Big Eagle one already. So check that one out, and the Winged Eagle one will be coming. Again, just one last look overall of... The, uh, the championship here, 
One thing I did just notice here is that it looks like there's a little bit of fading or tarnishing on the plate right here. The gold plating's probably coming off. Again, no big deal though. So just giving you a bit of a look. There's your famed logo. And boom. Love it. All right. Well, thanks once again, guys. If you have any questions, throw them in the comments. We'll talk to you later. Bang, bang.